Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Sunburn by a Series 16. These bridges are made from natural light, blah blah blah, you get the GLaDOS quote. Welcome to Sunburn, a medium hard difficulty light bridge and repulsion gel puzzle in my first Portal 2 map of 2018. This is probably my largest and most complex chamber yet and has taken me the most time to plan and build. My goal was to create a chamber that was more intricate and required several steps to complete, but still fun and challenging. I hope I succeeded in that goal. As a bonus, find the hidden companion cube and bring it to the exit. As always, feedback is appreciated. If you think you've got any exploits or unintended solutions, please let me know and I will fix them ASAP. Right, I will be right back to make sure the audio is okay. Alright, I'm back. Audio is good. Let's jump straight into the map. Interesting. So eventually we're gonna want to come back here. And I'm guessing we're gonna need Bounce Shell here to get back up here, and then we're gonna put Bounce Shell here to get up there. That would be my guess. So let's just go ahead and jump on down. What is around the corner here? Quite a lot of glass. Right. Those are flip panels, alarmingly. Ooh, it's gonna be a challenge even to just get back over there, isn't it? Might have to use a funnel in that case. What do we have over here? Hmm, interesting. There's some grating there. And we can shoot through the grating. Yep. It's also possible to jump over it, interestingly enough, so if we find a way to get any bounce shell here, we could just jump over. Although it might be intended for us to jump from there to here, because that also allows gel on it, interestingly enough. Aha, there's the gel dropper that I've been thinking of this whole time. We've got a little cleansing gel spot for cleansing off cubes if need be. That's good to know. Flip panel. Fizzler. Ooh, a light bridge, fancy that. Can't really actually get anywhere useful with it just yet, but it's a thing we have access to. Yeah, we can't even get up to it without Bounce Gel. Right, so, let's just go ahead and head up there, and see what the deal is with this area. Just a rear little portal surface, nothing special there. Alright. I don't see a good way to get any Bounce Gel there, so that's still gonna limit us. Let's put some Bounce Gel there, why not? Oh, that's not quite what I expected, it's not a- it's not a bomb, it's a flow. Interesting. Don't need any here. Oh, what is that for? Ooh, I know what that's for. Let's go ahead and tackle that problem, shall we? There we go. There we go! Look at that! Perfect. That's probably a return path. Looks like it to me. Give me this cube. Let's- let's go back from whence we came. There we go, no return path for us, that's probably what this is, yeah, that's just the return path. Don't need to worry about that. Just if you get trapped. Right, so, now... Put that there, that there, now we can get up there without portals, so that's nice. Yep, no portals necessary for that. And, let's also, let's also do this, so that we can get up onto the light bridge without portals. There we go. That should be sufficient. Kind of. Not really. Huh. I mean, the light bridge is slightly higher than two blocks. I can crouch up onto it. I'm hope- I'm hoping that's intended, because otherwise I don't know why this is here. I'm hoping that being able to crouch onto the light bridge like that is intended. I- cause that's what I'm gonna be doing throughout this whole- this whole puzzle. Alright, so. First things first, let's go down here, and we want to place the portal approximately there-ish. That should do. Then, let's jump up over this. There we go. And then we're gonna go and get on the light bridge. Let's run over here. Save some time. There we go. Now, so now we can get across over here and see what this area is all about. That's probably where a funnel's gonna come from. And it would seem we need some gel here to jump up. What's around through here? Return path? Return path, gotcha. Let's do that. 
And we can get up here. There we go. Right. Don't know if we need the key with us just yet, but I guess we'll find out. What do we have up here? Hmm. Okay, so that... That's where we just were, right? I wonder why we're able to see through to here. I haven't actually found a funnel yet, though. Hmm. Oh, we want the light bridge, actually. Yeah, not the funnel, duh! <laughs> we want to use the light bridge there. Okay, so let's move the cube. Cube doesn't need to be there anymore. Come here, cube. We're gonna put- oh, yeah. <laughs> that was real dumb of me. Let's see where I- where did I save? I don't remember where I saved, but I think I saved in a reasonable location. Oh, I saved here. Alright, that- that worked out just fine. Alright. Uh, nope, not up here. Actually, we need to go this direction. Here we go. There we go. Walk across here. Do that. And we need the gel up here. There's that. And... save. Game saved, excellent. Alright, so let's go ahead and, and take the bridge path. That seems like a reasonable thing to do. There we go. Now we're up here, we can put the cube on this button. And that should, for the most part, be... okay. Hmm. So I think now we want to go back... And we'll shoot the portal through the death- the death grill. We don't want to walk out from here, that would be a bad thing. Yeah, alright, so, let's walk back across here. And do that. There we go. That allows us to walk all the way back here. So now... Ah, we don't actually need gel here, we need gel there. Easy enough to pull off. Alright. Hmm. So we need the cube here as well. That's interesting. How might we accomplish that? Because the cube doesn't. I mean, it does auto-respawn, but it doesn't land on any sort of portal surface or anything. Hmm... Oops, come on now. I'm messing this up. There we go. Oh, and now those are disabled. Interesting. Because I put the cube on the button, right? Let's go back over here and, and see what to do about this. What is this about? I bet that has to do with an optional companion cube right there. I'll bet you anything that this is an optional companion cube. My thinking is that if I place my black portal instead when we get over there, it should allow us to at least get the cube in position. But then I'm not sure what to do. Oh, and I can just hop back over to get back in. Right, okay. I see now. I see now. It makes sense. Right, so. Leave our green portal there. And... Yes. We do this. Take the cube. We can just go through this portal surface, and then we don't need the green portal there anymore. 
Hmm. Right, so now... Leaving our portals... There we go. Now we can do that. We can easily hop back into here and get the light bridge again. And then later the gel. There we go. Let's walk all the way over here to the light bridge. Oh, come on now. There we go. Forgot to crouch. Oops, that is not the key I wanted to press. I wanted to press E, not 3. There we go. Put the key on the button, and... Now. Now is when we get the gel. So let's go do that real quick. Gel, please. Thank you. And I don't actually know if we need a light bridge up here or anything. So let's find out. Nope, that's just the exit. Awesome. Right, so, I would class that as an easy medium puzzle. Uh, it definitely was enjoyable. So, yeah, nice work. And I like the design of it. Cool. Right. Well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye! Wait, 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 just a second, the video's not over yet. I forgot about the optional companion cube. So, I think having the cube on this button is probably what does it. That would be my guess, that's how I would do it. And, uh, hmm, what's the best way to do this? Let's just head out here, and do that again. I'm betting if we stand on that button as well, yeah. Stand on both- have bu both buttons pressed, one of them by the key, one of them by us. Let's go over here. Let's get the music playing again. There we go. Walk all the way across here. And... Yeah! There it is! Right. Let's get ourselves a companion cube. Let's, we need to bring it to the exit and fizzle it. There we go. So, Companion Cube acquired. It looks like it does not auto-respawn, so we have to be very careful with it. Right. Let's bring this guy carefully up and around. Let's put it here, and we'll basically do exactly the same thing that we've already done. Should be pretty straightforward. Hmm. Actually, no, I can't do that just yet. Cause, uh, I need to... Yeah, need to move this... here. Let's just leave it there for now. Uh, hmm. What is the best way to get back, anyway? Oh, I have to use the anti-trapping thing. Alright, we have to go through here. And yes, that fizzler did just turn on. They turn on when you first look at them. At least they played the animation of turning on, anyway. Interesting. Right, so. Our quest to get the companion cube has begun. We've already- we already have the cube, and you just need to transport it to the exit now. Right. Walk all the way over here. And... oh, come on. There we go. So now we can walk over here, get the cube. Let's see... Let's put it on the button. We'll do this, as usual. You do this first. Whoa! Eh, forgot about that. <laughs> Alright. Save and continue. Walk all the way down here. Do with this. And it is trivial to get to the exit from here. There we go. Take this. Alright, so, let's put this guy in a safe place, because we need to get gel here. I, I saved before getting the gel, unfortunately. So. Let's put our black portal over there. There we go. Walk through it. Get up here. There we go. Walk all the way over here, get the light bridge so we can get across properly. Actually, I wonder. Let's- let's test this without the light bridge. I wonder if I can actually get gel where I think I can. Kinda, yeah, that works too. Yeah, we'll do that. 
Yeah, so you don't actually need the light bridge for that last part. And again, I'm not sure how intended my ability to get up on the light bridge is, but I mean, it feels like it's intended. Alright. Save with the cube in our hands, and... There we go. Right. Well guys, surreal this time, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!